In this video, we're going to look at how to use the function date diff to calculate the age based on a date of birth. First thing I'm going to do is go to design view on the form so we can actually edit it, and I'm going to add a new text box. So I'm just going to make this a bit bigger and add text box. Like everything you do in Access, you have to label everything. So I'm going to label this age. And I am also going to name it in the property sheet. And I'm going to call this age box. As you can see already on my form, I have got a date of birth. And the idea is I'm going to use that date of birth to calculate the date, or the age, sorry. So as before, I click on it, I go to data and I go to control source and I use the expression builder to, to put the formula in. I then put in date diff and as you can see as I start typing it it appears so I'm going to just double click on it and date diff is made up of three key parts. The first part is interval now this is a little bit more complicated to, to consider but essentially if you're subtracting two dates from one another, you need to work out the units, whether you're going to return the answer in uh, years, months, days, hours, or whatever. In this case, we want the age, and we want the age returned in years. So, I put in this, four Ys. Okay? The four Ys represent year, so 1994, 2005, so it's, it's that element of it, so it's why it's four Ys. Then we put a comma in. To go into the second bit. Now the first date is the earlier of the two dates. In this case the earlier of the two dates is the date of birth. So on my field list I'm going to scroll down, I'm going to find the date of birth which is here, I double click on it to add it in. Notice that the date of birth is surrounded by those square angle brackets which refers to um, a form element on the page. The second one is the later date. Now, in order to work out someone's age, you have to subtract their um, date of birth from the current date. So to work out the current date, today's date, I use the function date. Okay. Notice that I have put an open and close bracket after the word date. The date function simply returns today's date. And that's it. That will now subtract um, the date of birth from uh, today's date. I click on OK and I click on Form View. I then will select the date of birth. I'm just going to change the year so you can see the difference. So 20, uh, 2001. Hit Enter. And as you can see, the age updates as well.